So Gwen Fink coming up next for North Carolina here. Trying to follow up what Kaya Forbes did. High score right now on the bars for North Carolina is the 970. Oh, so Gwen Fink trying to come up here next. That's called a Jaeger huge front release move flipping and then grabbing the bar again forwards. Short on that last hand stand the judges really want to see within that 10 degrees on top of the bar. Great control on that dismount though. Huge release move. That's that Jaeger that I was just talking about earlier. Tried to get this landing. Just a small, the smallest of hops back. Now, Lali Dekanoidza will come up to anchor this bar's lineup for North Carolina. Welcome those of you who are watching hoops to Reynolds Coliseum in state rivalry North Carolina and NC State on this Sunday afternoon first rotation wrapping up here with Lally Dekanoidza on the bars for North Carolina NC State's already gone through their lineup on the vault NC State the only unbeaten team in the ACC this season North Carolina in search of their first ACC win and a good finish there for Dekanoidza on the bars. Cameron Rueda on the floor for North Carolina. They felt last week was her best trying to follow up on that performance from a week ago. Beautiful double pack from Cammy. Almost too much height and power off the floor. Feet too far in front of her. That's why she took that bigger lunge backwards, but stayed in bounds. So not incurring a deduction there. Nice flight on that one and a half twist to a front layout. Setting up for a final tumbling pass here. A double tuck. Nicely done. Stuck that last pass. Great control out of it. And really nice amplitude off the floor. Taking another look 
at this double pike. You can see how high she is. And staying in bounds, you can see those lines on the mat. That indicates to the judges where they're at when they land. If you step on or outside of the lines, it will be a 10 to 3 tenths in deduction. But she didn't get any because she stayed in.